Hello all. Welcome to this episode of our Sycamore Junior High Daily Video Announcements. Happy Wonderful Wednesday! Today is October 23rd. Hi, I'm Avi. And hi, I'm Haley. So our Sycamore Junior High, be safe, be responsible, be respectful, and be a problem solver. Thank you for doing the right thing and making good choices. Now it is time we all stand with our fellow aviators, place our hands over our hearts, and say the Pledge of Allegiance together. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Thank you all, and please be seated. You all are wonderful people. Keep being awesome and making this a great place to work. Be informed. Yes, be responsible and remember to check your emails. Know your important emails and delete the old. Now over to our wonderful school leaders. Hey, Sycamore Junior High, Principal Shunk and Officer Kassam here. We want to share with you some changes that are going to occur starting next Monday. Um, the way you move around the building is going to be a little bit different because we have a new feature on our courtyard which allows us to electronically lock and unlock those doors. So right now there's three doors in the courtyard that you can move throughout um, the courtyard. So the one by the main gym, into the academic area, and then by the media center. And those doors are now only, starting on Monday, are only going to be unlocked during bell change. So every 45 minutes they're gonna unlock for four minutes so that you can move about the building. But during the school day, or during your bell, I should say, like during class time, it is going to be locked. So that means that if you need to, during your class, get across the courtyard, you will not be able to do that. You're going to have to go around to the music area um, and down the athletic hallway to get across the courtyard. And this is a reminder that we're doing this to keep the building safer. Awesome. All right, guys, so we're going to put... Out a bunch of reminders this whole week news crew is going to be doing a lot but that's one big change that's going to happen next week on next monday so don't get locked in the courtyard next week see you guys is there anything new that we need to know for next week yes did you know that all the exterior doors around the building will be closed during class time starting next week no i didn't know this thanks for letting me know this information i now know no, not to go outside of the building during designated class time to avoid being locked out of the building now over to avi and the lead with their latest around the world in 180 days where they collaboratively showcase students joining our sycamore family from around the world wait that's me Welcome to this episode of Countries Around the World. Hi, I'm Avi. Hi, I'm Sophia. So our first question is, where are you from? Spain. And how's school in your country? It's, it's different than here. Okay. What's your favorite food? Um, uh, probably flan. And what is that? It's like a, like a custard, like dessert thingy. It has like caramel in it. I don't really know how to explain it. That sounds good. Mm-hmm. What do you like about your country? Um, I like, I like my family, the people there, mm -hmm. my friends there. Is there anything special that you would like to share about your country? Um, no, I don't think so. I think, yeah. Mm -hmm. Thank you. That was Countries Around the World. Next, Ryan O'Narlo will take us on in the More in Sycamore segment. Hey, I'm Ryan Haley, and I'm doing a segment where we interview new staff members. I'm here with... Miss Wapham, science teacher here at Sycamore Junior High. We're just going to ask you a couple of quick questions. The first one is, where are you from? I'm from here. I went to Sims Elementary and grew up in Sims Township. Where did you work before working here at the Sycamore Junior High? Before Sycamore Junior High, I worked at a couple of different schools, but the last one I worked at was Green on the red team. Red team is the best team. What has your experience been so far at the Sycamore Junior High? It's a great school to work, great people to be around, love the students. Shout out to my Science Bell 3. Uh, the staff members are all awesome, and I love being here. It's going to be a great year. Last one, what is a fun fact about yourself that you would like to share with the Sycamore Junior High staff and student body? 
Fun fact, I love being outside when I'm not a science teacher or the theater director here. I love being outside running or hiking or kayaking, anything, it's all great. All right. Thank you so much. That's Thank all you. we have today for the Moore and Sycamore. Thanks, Ryan and Arlo, and welcome to Sycamore. Okay, next is clubs and activities, announcement time. <laughs> robotics! A reminder that there will not be a robotics meeting after school today. Make sure to go home after school and be ready to share your ideas next Monday after school until 5 p.m. Boys basketball. All 7th and 8th grade boys interested in playing basketball should attend a meeting in the auxiliary gym today, October 23rd, during flex. All 7th and 8th grade boys and girls tennis players, even those who did not play on the school team, should plan on attending a meeting in the auxiliary gym with Coach Teets. The meeting will be tomorrow, Thursday, October 24th, during flex. Power of the pen. There will be no power of the pen practice this Friday due to conferences and no school for students. Hey, have you seen the Lost and Found lately? Bob, an evildoer, has an army. This army is very powerful if we don't stop it this week. Stop these water bottles from taking over the school by collecting them and claiming yours as your own. We must stop it. So claim your lunchbox. Get rid of all the disguises they can use. Collect your shoes. How do you even walk around in the school? Just collect them. Come save your stuff and get it before Bob's army takes it over on Thursday. Back to our crew. All unclaimed items will be donated to a local charity at the end of this week. We the People. We the People is an academic club for Sycamore Junior High students which teaches the history and principles of the American constitutional democracy. While promoting students' understanding of government, students learn about the importance and influence of the U.S. Constitution and the Bill of Rights. Club members will compete at the 2025 Middle School We the People Showcase in Columbus. There will be an informational meeting on Tuesday, November 5th at 7.15 a.m. in Junior High Room 2151. Club sponsors are Mr. Gudemuth and Mr. Brenner. If you have any questions. Well, that's all we have to for today. Be informed. Know your calendar. October 25th. Students have no school due to conferences. The 2025 Sycamore Junior High School yearbook is on sale now. Purchase today for the lowest price of the year. The low cost is $32 a copy. This price will increase to $35 next Thursday on October, on October 31st, 2024. All junior high ghouls and ghosts, get ready to show off your creative costumes this Halloween. That's next Thursday too. Here are the guidelines to keep it fun and safe. Costume rules. No weapons. No masks. Dress code applies. Keep it classy, everyone. And no disruptions. Costumes should let you sit, learn, and move without disrupting others. Remember, let's make this a Halloween a hauntingly good time while respecting our school environment. Next up, birthdays. Happy birthday to students celebrating today, Mia D and Elizabeth R. And happy birthday to staff member Coach Hunter. Everyone enjoy celebrating your special day. Yes, hope you all have a great time celebrating your special day. Shook of the day! Dogs can't operate MRI machines, but guess what? What? Cat scan. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> oh I cracked myself up. Well, that's all we have for today. Enjoy your day. And go, go Waves! waves.